good afternoon YouTubers here we are down in the man cave new project the roundhouse Katie here she is I've soldered her all up she's ready to be cleaned and uh, primed there's the uh, foot plate with the servo bracket connected which is on there these don't use the standard servo bracket uh, standard servo I should say um, you have to use uh, micro bracket uh, uh, servo but, um, I've got a couple of those I went and bought the standard ones thinking I could put the standard ones in here but I can't um, so yeah, here's the paint I'm using to uh, paint to the, um, that's the undercoat. I know she's going to be all completely black. So I'm using this um, engine enamel gloss paint, which is it's heat resistant. So you go with a boiler and anything that gets hot. It's, uh, because if you use some of the other paints, they're a bit soft. And they start to crack and uh, you end up re repainting so you might as well get the good stuff straight away don't mess about with this cheap stuff pound a can crap because it's no good get get your proper proper paint which is which is the edge primer roundhouse recommend the edge primer i found them up and i said what what do you use on your engines when you're selling the uh, complete engine they said you must use edge primer and um, they didn't say anything about any other paints but the edge primer is, is number one because it's because you're painting brass and brass doesn't like anything other than edge primer it's the same as galvanized um, that, that will spray you can protect that with galvanized as well so it's a good paint Here's some of the bits and pieces that you get from round S. Here's the here's the boiler, which is which is already already done for you really. All you have to do is just fit it. Um, it's a really it's a fantastic quality. Absolutely, they're expensive, but the quality is it's just outstanding. And here is the old smoke box. I mean, look at the look, look at the quality in it. It's just brilliant. Uh, I love I love round air stuff. Yeah, get what you pay for. Here's all the bits and pieces, they're all in a plastic bag. Uh, they're all sealed up. There's nothing loose. Uh, you, you can see everything in there, look. It's all in a plastic bag. It's really, it's really good stuff. Even the wheels are in a plastic bag. So you get a little spanner kit. There's the reverse gear shift. Um, but I've been using that, I'll be using remote control. Uh, there's everything in here. This is the remote control kit. Um, here's the other bits and this is the gas gas tank. I know it's in a plastic bag, you can't see it properly. But, um, there's the uh, there's a heat exchanger. No, sorry. Yes, I think so. Can't remember. There's the all other bits and pieces. There's the all the rails, all the fittings, the books and pieces I give you. Um, they even give you a uh, water it's like, like hypodermic. It won't be jabbed, jabby one of them, mate. Right? They give you the steam oil. You must use that's the steam oil. You must use your steam oil um, in your lubricator because any other oil is it's no good. It must be that. 
Um, I think that's why they give you that so you're not going to bug your engine up and make sure you use it all the time. Last, last for ages. Here's all the other bits and pieces. I love the way they, they put everything in a plastic bag all sealed up. Brilliant. But I will be running through the build and uh, I'll be doing some little videos. Yeah, I'm quite pleased with that. So I'm going to sign off for now, YouTubers, because it's absolutely belting down. It's a crap day here. That uh, gives me something to do in the shed. Got my heater on. And I'm happy. Go and have a cup of tea. And, uh, see you later, YouTubers. I'm still doing the, uh, the shuttle, the Stairbridge shuttle. She hasn't gone on hold for a long, for much, but this has just come in and I just want to have a go and have a look at it and unpack it all and make sure all the bits are here and I can steadily plod on. There's a lot of spraying to do. I, uh, I've got to spray everything. So I've done, I soldered the body up last night. Uh, it's okay. Got a little bit of excess solder. I'm going to rub that down, get rid of it. But uh, yep, yeah, I'm going to go now and uh, have a cup of tea. Come back and do a bit of cleaning and a bit of, probably a bit of spraying. Get some of the bodies warmed up a bit so I can spray them. And um, see how we get on. So probably see you tomorrow, YouTubers. So keep dry and have a great afternoon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.